Army Men episode 168. Back at the Green Hideout, David's Hideout, where he is on a three win streak after securing another one in the last one. Now he's going for four. Sid hoping he can finally get it. Yeah, you pretty much know the drill with these. I know I mentioned the streak stuff a lot, but I just feel like I have to in that case. Especially with the fact that they want to go for that record. But, returning to David's hideout. Hoping to get four in a row, but said as usual, he wants to try to stop him. The question being though, will he apply any tricks in this? We'll have to see. So let's get going with it. Back in my hideout, boys. Where hopefully we can continue the win streak. Yeah, but you have won on my turf before, David. You've won at my tan hideout, so I'm going to win at your green hideout. Now, I've done it already a bit, too, I think, of winning here. It's where I'm finally going to break your win streak, because I haven't won since episode 164. 165, 166, and the last one, 167, have all been won by you. 164 is my last win. And your last loss. But now I'm going to make sure to get that win in this one, because you're not getting that record. I'm going to get it before you do. Well, we'll see, because there is a chance I can win it and get to four. So don't start acting cocky thinking you've already won. I'm not being cocky, but I'm feeling encouraged, and I'm not confusing it. So, clink the dice and let's get ready, David. Let's go. First dice roll goes to me. Good start. Hopefully it's a good number. Five of them, yes. Now I have to ask as well, any tricks? Well, I haven't set up a sniper, have you? No. You haven't made any deals with a clone, have you? Why would you even ask that? I already said I'm never making a deal with him again, after he cost me that one episode plenty of episodes ago, where I made a deal with him, where I would finally win again because you had that huge win streak of eight wins at least, around eight or nine, where you were close to the record, but I'm not making a deal with him again. Never again. Because I know that if I tried again, I'm going to lose again. Well, of course you've lost without making deals with him too, you know. Yeah, but it won't be a guaranteed loss if I don't have his support or anything. Got that one too. Only one... Well... Yeah, I'll do the barricade thing here too. When it lands on a one, take out one guy from the barricade. Until it's gone. Damn it, that's your first dice roll win. I only won two of them before you got one. And you got a two. Ow. Shit. Three of them. Yeah. Oh, that dude who was already knocked over, he got picked up by them. Yeah. Dang it. If I try to hire a sniper right now in the middle of the battle, he might notice. Because I haven't done that before, putting one up in the middle. I'm really going to have to find tricks, whatever I can, without manipulating the dice so that way I can get a win. But I remember, he had a green spy here in one of the previous episodes. I don't know if I'm going to try a tan spy, because he's going to find out because of the wearing a fucking wire. Let's just keep going. Damn it! Well, three dice rolls, you've won. Now you might take the lead with it. Three of them. Yeah, I think you're in the lead now. Well, not by much, though. There's still a chance. I'm being fair with it. Okay, got that one. Low number reversal. Four of them. Oh, shit. Oh, he almost hit his head on that. Damn it. Two. 
What the fuck with that, with that little thing? Did his gun malfunction and explode and kill him? Oh, first double of the battle. Damn it! Of course you get the double. Don't be a high number. You got the maximum. Six, that's twelve. Three, four, five, and six. And that's six. Seven, eight, nine, ten, one. Oh my god. Yeah, move these guys up and start bringing up 10 reinforcements. Not good, man. What we had with a good start with an early lead, now he's already taken it. He's already taken the lead. It ain't over yet, though. Yeah, but if it continues this, continues at this rate, then you're gonna get that win and get the four in a row, which I should be at that right now, not you. Well, you gotta deal with it, Sid. You always gotta complain about the win streak and the rules. I'm not even complaining about rules. You technically are. No, I'm not. And if you don't stop with that, I'm gonna kill you. Why do you always gotta keep threatening me with that, and yet you don't do it? You're not going to kill me. You're not going to threaten me with it either because you can't kill me either. Well, you're not claiming that you're immortal. Neither are you. Well, I'm only saying that in the sense that none of us can be killed because then there would be no importance of the series then without any of us. Where if it's just one of us, then that's not the thing. It, the series has to have both of us. Just like how a movie and a show, it's like a bit pointless if they kill a central character off like way too early in the movie or whatever, or show. Like you gotta have them there to do it because how are you gonna tell it with the rest of the backing guys without the central one? The rest of the storyline. Another double. Let me get this one. Yes! Well, three, that's six. I didn't get 12, but six will do. Another one. Jesus, that's third double now. And it goes to David. Fuck. Only slightly less. It's five, that's ten. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Come on, man. Don't start putting your heads in your asses, because now we're really falling behind. This is not what we need right now. Another double. That's four now. That one goes to Sid. They've each won two doubles. Back to you now. Got that. I got the same thing. Now I kill ten of you. Alright. Pretty much about time to bring up green reinforcements. Well, you shouldn't be too far ahead now, David. I'm pretty much about at least right there with you on the amount of men. And one barricade guy is gone already, and none of my barricade guys are gone yet. They will be soon. Yeah, it might be too late by the time you finally kill one of them. The next roll I win, even if it's a one, yeah, it won't be much, but I will get one of them. Yeah, you just keep saying that to yourself, David.
Oh really Sid, that's how you want to be? Try out like some little macho -y tough guy? Well I will. I'll do it more than you, brother. You don't have the power of that, Sid. You know it. The things you say to try to claim that you have and own when you really don't. Yeah, what about you? And your little prowess. And you got nothing to say on that? I don't have to brag about owning that kind of stuff, Said You know it. Oh yeah, of course. You want to try to claim that? Oh, if I brag about having these kinds of macho -y powers, you're going to think I'm some egomaniac. Not exactly. Well, anyways, just get your men shut up there, David. And then we can finally continue. Because I got a dodgeball with your face on it. Oh, really? Yeah, I think I might have mentioned this Edda and Eddie scene. I might have mentioned it or might not have. But if I hadn't, well, yeah, it's the episode where... Sarah has the Eds actually watching Jimmy and they try to do fun things with him. One of them has dodgeball where Eddie has the dodgeball and Double D has an intense fear of it. And then Eddie actually draws Double D's face on it. And Double D just breaks down because of his huge fear of dodgeball as he puts it. It's gym class all over again. Yeah. Alright, I got that one. Only one. Well, there goes another barricade guy. Six. You better not go down yet. You beat me in this one. I really am going to kick your ass, Dave, because I'm tired of fucking losing. The fact that you have three in a row. Okay, I got that one. Six. Now I get a six. Yeah, keep killing them. Five. Hopefully we're catching up now. Three. Let those bodies hit the floor. Because gotta be right. This is our fight. And yeah, I know I titled the last one This Is Our Fight. And I'm not going to put that title again, of course, for this one, but... Few dice rolls in a row that I've won, killing them. Only one! Well, only one barricade guy left. Damn it! And then you finally win our dice roll. Four. Ugh. Get out of there. Check me out, I'm your cool one. What are you trying to claim? <laughs> Low number reversal on your ass, bitch. Six of them. Keep them coming. Two. Yeah, getting them. Six. <laughs> 
Reject. Three. One, three. Come on, pick up. Four. Well, time to bring more up. Alright, we need to get it. Kind of wish I was able to set up a spy now. Although he's gonna notice. I know David's gonna try to. He likes to try to exploit all my tricks. But something will be done. Hopefully we're not too far behind if he's still in the lead. Might have to sound the alarm. <laughs> I'm gonna have to sound an alarm. What do you mean sound the alarm, Sid? What? Sounding the alarm? Yeah, because I feel like there may be some suspicion up. I told you, I don't have anything. I don't have any sniper sub. I don't even have a spy out again because I know if I try that again, like that one episode, then you're going to find it again. Yeah, I still can't believe what that tricked me and made it look like there was finally a traitor on your side, but when it was a fucking spy the whole time. And it was in this spot too where the green spy one occurred. It was in this spot at your hideout. Except it was at night. It wasn't in the day. Yeah, I know that. Alright, let's go. Four. And yet, when you get your rolls, yeah, my Barricade K guys are up, but you're actually still getting decent numbers on killing my men. Well, eventually, once you do run out of the reinforcement, then I can get your barricade, guys. Because now, it looks like you have to set up men. Alright. I really hope we're at least right there with you, if you're still in the lead. Because it's about time I get a win again, because this win streak of yours cannot go on forever. Same with you when you get one. But I want to at least beat the record before you do. Then that way I can finally wrestle on the whole thing. But that's another problem then, like I pointed out plenty of times before. You're letting the win streak get to your head, Sid. What about you? You've been mentioning getting it too. Well, except I'm more focused and calmer with that than you are. It's not getting to my head as much as you. You are flat out obsessed with getting that highest win streak, Sid. You know it. And that's a part of the reason why you've lost. You want to call that another part of why I've lost just because I'm obsessed with a win streak? Yeah, because you let your focus of that get in the way of any actual thoughts of trying to get your men to win. That's pretty much a part of why you've lost the last few. I've had episodes where I've been on that high obsession of the win streak where I still win because then I have that determination and fire to do it. That's what you seem to forget, David. So yeah, I know that more than you do. Yeah, we'll see about that. Just watch and see your cockiness and your obsession of the win streak really get to your head too much into this one that you really will have that bad ego and you're just going to get embarrassed. I'm not going to get embarrassed. Just watch. Let's go. Got that one. Five of them. Oh, he was laying on the side there, laying down guy was. 
Pachow, pachow. Got that one. Two. Four. I'll see. Now oh, this dude ain't out yet. No. Well, you finally let her on the one, so there goes one barricade guy. Three. Chow. Slice them up. Slice these little bitches up. Six of them. Three. Oh no. Five. Another double. Old David got it. Shit. Two X four. Come on. Four. You fall in a little chain line. Play doctor for five minutes flat. Another four. Keep getting fours. Yeah, can you see? Ugh. Six. Time to bring up more. Yeah, unfortunately, I think you're still in the lead despite some of those consecutive dice rolls I got. I think somehow you're still in the lead. But the only turns I've really led was the first couple. Then by the time you started winning dice rolls, you took the lead. Because let's see. I don't have a huge amount of reinforcements left. Well, I don't think you're going to run out here, Sid, but... I mean, close, at least. You will get to having to bring some of yours up soon, though. So that pile as a whole is getting smaller and smaller. there. Got that one. Three of them. Old David again. Old Sid got it. 
three. Fuck. Four of them. Well, here come more of yours. Oh, that's gonna be a lot. That one barricade guy is still holding on for dear life. You know, he is quite the fire to still hold on like that. And then, yeah, you still only have three. You still got three of those barricade guys. I've only taken out one of them. Yeah, because then in a way, it's somewhat bad with that because you've been getting higher than one most of the time. A good part on why you're still in the lead. Because you haven't gotten a huge amount of ones or really low numbers in general. As for your reinforcements, mm, Now let's see, a good amount of David's reinforcements are coming up, so will he run out? Don't you dare. Do not to do it. Reset him up. And sorry if the way I grab some of the men, my middle finger is really showing in those. I'm not flipping anybody off, I promise. It's just, I'm grabbing them in just that random way. Although I have made David and Sid flip each other off before. Oh, wait a minute, now it looks like you have less reinforcements than me. I might have finally retaken the lead. I've retaken the lead. Yes. We have a chance to win. Yeah, you're not out of reinforcements yet, but you only got four left. As soon as I get a four or higher on my next kill and roll, all of them are coming up. Because I got more reinforcements than you do. So I'm in the lead, David. I've taken the lead back. First time leading since near the beginning of the battle. So I'm telling you, the comeback is coming. Here we go. Six of them, yeah, they're coming up. Or even if I had gotten a one to take the barricade guy out, they would still come up. But I got a six. Yep, good job, Sid. Making a little comeback, but I can still win, you know. Don't forget it. Yeah, I know you still have a chance, unfortunately. But yeah, you are out of reinforcements. Three of them. Another three. Jesus. Well, at least it's somewhat helping. I'm in the lead. Got the one. Well, I know there's still plenty of them. So, only one. But he's gone. So your barricade is out. So there goes David's barricade. Yeah, I'm winning the dice rolls. I could have a chance to win this. This loser streak will finally be over for me. Another three! Jesus. We're not even at my hideout, and the surface of this area apparently affects the dice too to landing on the same numbers most of the time. So 
So both our hideouts have that magic. Okay, is it gonna land on a three again? Oh no, six. That's better. Oh shit, hit his head on the pole. Keep going, boys. That win is in our sights. I can see a capital V victory coming from a mile away. Damn it. Five. Back to killing you. Four of them. Oh shit, he almost went flying all the way off. Two. Zero. Oh. Shit. You got a two. Ah! Shit. It flew underneath there. I see it though. Okay, so that was David's dice. Roll his again. Oh, and he won that still. Two. Another one. Three of them. Come on, now you want to start catching up? Another double. It's kind of risky. Well, David got it. Three out of six. Yeah, there's definitely at least six. Three. You're almost in that range. It looks like any number I get, yeah, you'll be in the range, even a one. Okay, four. Three men left. You're gonna lose, David. I'm gonna beat you. Get the three. Okay, one, you're at two. Get the two. Yes! Already got him. Get over here, David. No! Four of them. Alright, go ahead and move them. And looks like we could have the rest of Sid's reinforcements coming up. So let's see. But you got a lot of reinforcements to take out, David. So this could be a chance I can give you one of your worst defeats in a while. I can catch up, though. That has happened for both of us. We each take out a bunch of... I'll even say this. You may have lost the last one, but you did almost pull off a comeback where there were a lot of my men left and you actually managed to kill a bunch of them. It was either the last one or the one before the last one, but you actually almost pulled off a comeback, I'll give you that. You lost, but you almost pulled it off. You didn't get an embarrassing defeat because you did manage to take out reinforcements. And I could do the same here. Take all of them out and get you an HP. Even if I lose, then I wouldn't have an embarrassing defeat.
Well, we shall see about that. Yep, that is going to be all my reinforcements coming up. So here we go. Oh shit, you're already going to kill some of them. Three of them. You better stand up. And again, sorry if my middle finger's coming out in that way. I swear, I'm not flipping anybody off. It's just the way I'm randomly grabbing them. Taking some HP out of you. Two, you're at 18. Twelve. Oh, you're already almost halfway. Yeah, we can try a double. If I win the double, though, and I get a six, you lose. Oh, I won the double. If I get a six, you lose. Because you're at 12. So, it's going to be a bad defeat. If I land on a six, you lose. Ah, oh, three, that's six. But you are in the range now at six. Jeez, lost six is in there. But you're in the range. But I could still get a double and land on a three to beat you. Come on. Or I could land on a regular six right here. Ah, oh, two, you're at four. Damn it, you're killing more men. Six of them. Come on, men. We got him right where we want him. He's in the range. We need to beat him now. And finally end it, because this could be it. We have our chance to end this losing streak. Don't blow this lead. Don't choke this lead away. Do not choke this lead away. We're right there to finally get a win again. We need this so bad. Get the four. Damn it, I don't need five. Oh, and you're killing more men. Five of them. Get the four. One, you're at three. Get the three. Okay, two, you're at one. So no more doubles for the battle. Shit. Six of them. Get the one. I actually need the one. Oh, and it landed on four. Damn it. Well, I don't need it now, but damn it. Five of them. So that's going to be all three barricade guys plus two of them. Come Sid's barricade. See, just like that, I'm reducing your reinforcements. Pulling off a supposed comeback so far. Do not get the two. Missed. Got another shot. Missed again. Get the one. Damn it, I don't need four now. It's too late to get it now. Okay, got another shot. Get the one. 
Stop landing on four. I don't need it now. Cannot do doubles now. Stop laying on doubles. We can't do them anymore for this battle. David's at one. Do not get the two. Missed, but that was close. One, I'm at, got one guy left. Come on, my last guy beat him. Let me get the one now. Damn it! Cannot do doubles. Stop. Oh my god, we might have another lengthy battle on our hands here, getting the numbers. Let me get it here. I don't need four. I need one. I actually need it. Oh my god. Yes! Gotcha, David! Finally, losing streak is over! Good job, guy. You will get a special treat for helping me win. A special treat at the dinner fest we will have for this party. Good job. Take that, David. Finally beat you. First win since episode 164. So yeah, get to bring your flag down. Yes. Sweet victory. The power of the sweet victory song in Spongebob helped me win. You didn't mention the song during the whole battle until now, right after it ended. Well, I still won. It is a sweet victory, as I see it. So, now it's time for me to have a win streak. So my first win since episode 164, and your first loss since episode 164. Finally beat you again. And it feels good to finally be back in victory lane. Yeah, good job, Sid. But you gotta know that I'm at least a bit more of a fairer sport than you because you like to be jerky with your wins and such. And I like a really poor sport when you lose. I'm not being the complete jerk, at least, when I win. Well... You didn't win here, David. You lost, so that's my first win in a few episodes. I finally got another one. There's really not much to do here. I don't think even the clones here. But I do know that once we get down to the final stretch of episodes, the 190s, and then get to 200, that's where he's definitely going to become very prominent. Where we can start having our story stuff in there of taking him down. But until then, he's going to make sporadic appearances before 190. Because I have a feeling that at least in 190, he's going to appear in that entire final stretch and all of those up to the final episode. But we don't have to deal with him today. So that's at least a bit good. Because even then, I don't think even he would ruin my good mood right now with this win. So, might as well get back in there, David. Yeah, we'll see how far your win streak can go before you finally lose again. Because you, you may not know... You never know, Sid. Your win streak could end in the next one. Well, it's not even a streak, but you probably won't even get to two. 
We'll see about that. I'll make sure that I do. As a matter of fact, the next episode we will have is actually the Christmas Eve battle. Because that will be this Friday. Friday's Christmas Eve. So the next episode we're in is the Christmas Eve battle. And then we're going to be battling Saturday as well for the Christmas Day battle. Yep, so that's going to be special ones. So we might as well get prepared for that. But anyways, time for me to celebrate this victory. Yeah, I'm out. Now I'm going to make sure to win those too, so that way I can be the ultimate winner of the holiday battles for this year. Because David won the Halloween battle. I won the Thanksgiving one. And especially the Christmas Day one is the one I need to win. If David wins the Christmas Eve one, fine. But if I win that, then that's really good. But I have to win that Christmas Day one. To make sure that I am the ultimate winner of the holiday battles for this year. To wrap up this year. So I'm out. So yep, that's it with this episode. And yep, next time Friday is Christmas Eve. So there will be a Christmas Eve battle. And then... I had said that I'm not doing much uploads on the weekends now, any new uploads at least, but this Saturday will be an exception because Saturday is Christmas Day, so I will do one on that. And then I'll wrap up the holiday battles for this year, and then really about only a, another episode or two, and then I'll wrap up 2021 for the Army Men at least, and still a bit of cartoon review stuff for the year, and then I'll be all set and ready for what I'm going to do for 2022. So anyways, that concludes this episode and I'll see you guys next time.